happy day I'm with you. And I love Asian cinema. I love Asian comedy. I just love to see what my Asian brethren are up to. Okay, so today we're gonna watch some scripted Asian gifts, and most of these are TikToks. And this subreddit is kind of dedicated to like making fun of like how these aren't funny, but I feel like I'm gonna like them. This is a TikTok, and I have a little story about it, but we're gonna watch it first. <laughs> Oh, it's so good! I saw this on a meme account, and I know for a fact that this is a TikTok. I recreated this, I wanted to credit it, but nobody ever credits these guys and it's always cropped like this. It got 37 million views when I made it, and I had a scandal, guys, because another guy must have recreated it, and that guy, like, took a lot of the credit for it, and I got yelled at by so many nine-year-olds for not crediting him. I had to, like, apologize, like, it was a whole mess, but I credited him in my TikTok video, but, like, this GIF has caused me a lot of pain, but also a lot of views. I'm a little conflicted. If you know who these guys are, please leave a comment. Girl's trying to eat a cracker. She can't really fit it in. I mean, I'm sure if she could open- Oh. <laughs> oh, I mean, that's kind of creative. Now, is this Asian TikTok? And is regular TikTok banned in North America? I want to know. He doesn't realize that you're supposed to press the glass against the thing. This guy knows how to do it, though. Oh, that's actually kind of smart. I think that these are funny because they're just fun and they're just playful and they're just like trash. I just love fun and playful trash. Oh, this guy lets the girl cut in line. Oh, and then everybody lets him cut in line. I mean, the part that's not cool about it is that it's definitely scripted, but like, it's kind of cute. This is like a why were they filming moment. Also, this guy's outfit, whoo, he's killing it. If I was a guy, this is how I would dress and this is how I would do my hair. And I would pray that my hair would look like that, but it probably never would. Oh, she's just putting her own arm around her waist. The jealous girlfriend theme, very, very popular for this type of comedy. Is it that so many women are jealous? I don't know. You see a lot of like wives like dragging their husbands by the hair away. And like, I guess to some people it's funny, but like that's the only thing that's kind of eh, for me. The old violence against the guy. Uh oh. Strict mom's coming in. Oh, it's a lollipop! And the mom's just smiling. If I was the mom, I'd be like, why do you have a lighter? Get that lighter out of here! You gotta admit, that's really cute. So like, jealous girlfriend and very strict controlling moms. Yes. And like the title here says India counts, right? Yeah, India's in Asia. Do I count as Asian? I'm half Asian. I'm Chinese and Malay. It's pretty Asian. Okay. <sighs> <laughs> this is a theme that is in some of these gifts that makes me uncomfortable. Maybe it's because I wear makeup, but girls eating a banana she's getting proposed to. A richer guy comes out with, how many carrots is that diamond? Holy. She doesn't really sparkle though, it can't be real, but this wouldn't be scripted otherwise. So she belligerently throws her banana on the floor. A guy trips and spills water on her face. Why would he wipe her face like that? And then that's what she looks like without makeup apparently. Wow. I feel like if she washed her makeup off, she definitely wouldn't reveal like that. These these girls without their false lashes, am I right? I don't know why that makes me uncomfortable. A lot of the transformation videos I've seen too, like they make me a little bit uncomfortable just cause like the transformation is so insane. I mean, people can do what they want with makeup. It makes me feel bad when like people make fun of them for doing makeup that they feel comfortable in. Oh, okay, I've seen this one before. Oh, okay, I can't even. Okay, so he drinks the milk. He's like, oh, have some, have some sweetie. Seems totally normal, right? I'm already gagging. <laughs> oh, the straws are connected, so she drank. Uh, milk from out of his mouth. Oh, that's so nasty. I can't stand it. That's not even funny. I like pranks that don't hurt anybody, but like people were hurt in the making of this prank. Uh, one time like a guy came over to my house. We had like a very casual house. It was like a frat house, like a bunch of young people living in it. And he like took my like milk jug and he drank out of it. And I was like, yo, like we are casual, but we are not that casual. For some reason, like the thought of someone else's spit like coming near my milk, like I can't stand it. These guys are so tall. Okay, so they say hi to the girl and then she dips her boyfriend's hand in water. But all I can think of is like, how are these guys so tall? Where'd they get these legs? I've heard that if you go to Hong Kong, like a lot of the girls are really tall and like, I'm jealous. This one's like not very funny, but her legs are putting on a show here. This guy tries to prank this guy. There's obviously a lid on the cup and this guy, instead of being like, that's mean, never do that again. He's like, oh, I'm gonna get my wife with this. This, this is one of those pranks that just keeps on giving. <laughs> Is there a filter on him? It's like his face kind of like got bigger and smaller. Do you see that? It's like, boom, boom. Don't touch people's computer screens, dude. Don't, oh. Oh, she's really quick. Her alt tab game, really quick. What game is she playing? Oh, she's playing Fortnite. <laughs> Typical. These two are in a bad situation. Surrounded. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and then the husband joins the circle. I don't know why, but that's like one of my favorite switcheroos. Like, do you guys remember in Anchorman? They're like facing up and they're like ready to fight and it's really intense. And then like Steve Carell's like on the wrong side. I don't know why, like switcheroos, hilarious. Oh, oh. 
Oh, got him. I mean, this guy should have known that something was coming. No one would just be like, hey, I'm gonna do this like thing that looks makes you look really cool. You're just gonna like poke these balloons with a toothpick. Obviously one of them is gonna be a water balloon. We all know how these things go. What is this thing? Is this some sort of contraption I've never heard of? Oh, oh, he got her a car. A beamer, a red one, holy. Oh no, it's a lighter. Oh my goodness. I was wondering why, instead of being happy, this dude who might be her boyfriend just runs away. He's like, oh, get me out of here. She looks like she's got a temper. <laughs> Although he's trotting, so like it's gotta be fake. He must be thinking really hard. He's about to solve like the craziest equation. Quick math. Oh, it's zero. Well, I would have known that too because I wanted to take calculus. I took pre-calculus. There were all these like foreign students like from Asia and stuff who were like in there with us and they were so smart and they helped to tutor me and stuff even though their English wasn't very good. And they were like, yeah, like we've been doing this kind of stuff since like the sixth grade. And I was like, dang, how are you guys so advanced? Like that sounds really stressful. But they like all of them just like barely showed up, barely studied. And then they got A's so easily. I had to work so hard for my A. Like it hurts so bad. <laughs> this is an anime betrayal. Where's her arm? She finds out that she doesn't have an arm, ties her shoes, and apologizes, but she had an arm all along. I mean, I could have known that. Get out of here, that one's so dumb. <laughs> Whenever like my Asian cousins are watching like these dramas that they watch, the only thing that I feel like they go overkill with is like the crying. <laughs> Like, it's just painful to watch. I can't watch people cry. And like, even like scripted stuff where people are crying, I'm like, ugh, like, I'd rather not. Oh, geez, that's, you can't just blow your nose and throw it on the ground, it's rude. What is this guy gonna do? He puts money on it? Oh, pretty clever. <laughs> the guy in the back, they're filming the script and they're like, your job right here is to give the old thumbs up at the end. Yeah. There's nothing more cute and wholesome than a thumbs up, even when it's fake. Is this an escalator? That looks like okay no he just walks like a swan his center of gravity is very low he just floats this girl takes a potato chip and eats it looks like she's working but she's seen death note before she's got like the mini tv in the chip bag i didn't know that people actually did that oh wait it's probably a phone i'm so stupid i'm like how'd she get a tv that small <laughs> literally have a phone on me oh that's gonna hurt it's gonna hurt real bad <laughs> This guy's like, you're the strongest man in the world. I can't believe it. Yeah, you gotta touch the rocks too and make sure that the rocks have like some extra weight to them. I'd be very critical of this man as well. I really wanna do something like this to somebody. Like the beauty of this trick is like, it makes you want to make somebody fall for it. You would feel like such a strong, unstoppable woman. If you did this, I'll have like Terry hand me the hammer. Just bang. Oh, they're having some, what is that, peeking duck? What, this is so elaborate. I can barely follow this. It is the most elaborate thing I've ever seen. Okay. All right. Baited the dog. Dog gets in trouble. Oh, poor dog. Just let him eat. What is go- What is this guy doing? This guy's going through a lot and his poor mother is slaving over the stove. Okay, I just like... Yo, this has been going on for uh, way too long. What was the point of the dog thing? Like she would have been distracted anyway and she drops it in the, like what? What? I gotta see the comments for this. Why didn't he just frame the dog for eating the food? So that she can see the candle. Okay, there's like, this is like a whole analysis. It doesn't stop, it keeps going. This is how to get rid of advertisers. Sign an autograph and give it back to them. Oh my God, that's so smart. But I'd feel like such a jerk if I did that. <laughs> that's really funny. If I was like one of those people that was like, will you take one of these? Will you take one of these? And like somebody signed it, I'd like hang on to it and be like, is this guy famous? So like, it's a really good way to like get them to take it back. But at the same time, I've heard that these people, they're not done for the day unless they hand out every last one of them. So I'm like conflicted. Do I like take it and put it in the garbage, which is wasteful, or do I like make them work longer? It's always like this crazy, like moral ethical battle in my brain every single time I get handed a piece of these papers. Here we go. Elaborate trick on mom again. Mom is making sure that he's studying and every time she slams the door, he like gets his phone back. Oh my goodness. I can't, I, I can't. How is this 15 seconds? It keeps going. It never stops. Does she ever find out? No, she doesn't. Ugh. I wonder how many like young people are like, that's a good idea, I'm gonna try that one. Ah. Although I feel like it might work, but like that's a lot of effort. The amount of time it takes him to like let go of the phone, I feel like you could just like shove it under your pillow just as fast. You have two options. Option A is to stay with your wife for the rest of your life. She's like, ah. Oh. 
Option B. He's like, B, 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 B. Again, this is like the, uh, the little pocket of comedy. I I'm just not receptive to it. Maybe it's because, like, I'm the jealous wife and I don't want to be left and I don't want to be alone. I feel like it's really low-hanging fruit, that's all. Even though I'm laughing at, like, classic switcheroos, I feel like this is the lowest hanging fruit. Guy steals her purse. She's looking for it as if she's blind. Oh, she must be blind. So he gives it back. And she's like, yeah, psych, not blind. And he's like, duh, uh. It's not an anime. Nobody when they're thinking in real life is like, huh? It's not how any of this works. Girl's holding a candy bag and people are walking by and taking the candy. It must be like she's giving them out for free. So this girl next to her is like, yeah, I'll have one too. But it doesn't seem to go over well this time because those people are her friends. And then she goes, the, <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, he got me. <laughs> I'm just gonna scratch my head now whenever I'm confused. I'm gonna be like, huh? I got the gist. It might have not translated if she didn't do the head scratch. She doesn't look like she makes a ton of facial expressions. Although what facial expression would you make? Like, That's what I would do. Cast me in these scripted Asian gifts. I swear, I'll, I'll be the lead actress. I'll do a good job. All right, another classic switcheroo. This guy's like, I can take this straw. And his friend just like grabs it. The girl's like, oh, oh my gosh, I can't believe it. You're so amazing. You're so amazing. This guy is the real illusionist, but I don't get how this girl didn't see any of it. The reason why magic tricks work is because we're so focused on the person doing the trick that we just don't pay attention to this guy. Although she doesn't look at her Coke once either. Like there's so many ways that this could go wrong, but it worked. Am I laughing? Absolutely not. Cool to see though. I love watching people be amazed. These for sure, all of them, 100% scripted. When your girlfriend tries to steal food. Okay, that's a little bit like obnoxious, the amount that she's taking. So he's like, here, just take it all and I'll switch it up. That's super mean. But you just know that when you turn the camera off, she was like, give me my food back, I'm starving. And also that ramen looks really, really good. This is like the long legged girl. All I can think of is how good that ramen looks like. That is a thick, juicy broth that I'd like some of that. That flavored egg, mmm. -hmm. This is called smooth flirting. Yeah, put the leg way up. That's like the most flirty hot thing ever. And this guy in the back sees and he's like, hey, I wanna give this go. I'm gonna give this go. Oh, I missed. Kicks her, roundhouse kicks her. She chases him with a broom. This is the pinnacle of comedy. This is not scripted. This is perfect. This should be the epitome of this genre right here. Needless violence. Mom, stop calling me. Yes, I'm with my boyfriend. Wait, I'll send you a photo. Takes a picture of a random guy and kisses him, which is, uh, I mean, I think that's assault. Oh, hey, he didn't scratch his head. <laughs> You're supposed to. That's how these gifts work. This one is a rule breaker. Although because he didn't scratch his head, do you notice that they like put the question marks? Just to make sure that you know. Oh, this is the girl that got pranked. She pranked someone else into holding her hand. Help me, I'm confused. This handhold is lasting way too long. I feel uncomfortable. Get me out of here. Scripted haircut. Here we go. <laughs> Yo, did that work? He's got like a patch there. Oh, no, 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 no. So this guy like knows it's a phone. So that's how this guy was able to like get in with that. Oh my goodness, no. Unbelievable. How to win an arm wrestle. What do you do? I need tips on this. Oh, you, what do you bribe him? <laughs> you bribe him to impress the girls. There you go. He's opening the door for her. He's like, move, move. I'll pick you up and I'll move you myself. Even though we're in matching jackets, let's pretend we've never met each other ever. This isn't scripted at all. What about me? Lift me up. <laughs> All right. Wait, maybe he's like saving her from getting run over by this obviously violent, crazy man. Her boyfriend's back is to her, so why is she like? Does not compute, makes no sense to me. Those shorts look really painful. Ah, ooh, I felt that. I felt that in my rear end. I actually clenched my butt cheeks. I guess she's wearing these as a preventative measure because guys like to uh, butt bump with her on the train. Why would he do that? I've met my fair share of creepy guys, but no guy has ever been, <laughs> has never like butt bumped me when I was out in public. Although it would be just as bad if it was a hand too. Okay, that's just mean. Thank you. Someone's gotta put a chair. No, no, that's just mean. At least put the chair back. Oh my goodness. Wow. This is the dude perfect of scripted Asian gifts. Whoa, that's impressive. Honestly, one day I just want to dedicate an entire day to getting like these weird, oddly satisfying thingies. Also, again, these girls' legs are so long. I'm so distracted. Where'd you get that from? How to bag a bad girl. So he makes her drop her purse. And then the jealous girlfriend, as usual, is like, no, pick mine up, mine first. And he's like, oh, what do I do? Here, you're more important. To Oh, okay, that's good. <laughs> oh, the jealous girlfriend theme. We love that. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Terry, will, will you do this one to me? She so obviously like puts her face first when she comes out. <laughs> yeah. You gotta make like the kissy face when yeah, you're you running out. You gotta walk through a door like this. 
<laughs> like some people run face first though. One time we were playing hide and seek in my basement and my sister like was running, like she was running while she was laughing. She was like, ha 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 ha. And she ran into a wall and there's like two little teeth marks in the wall, like two little chiclets, like an indent. And it was the funniest thing I've ever seen. And her teeth like kind of stuck out a little bit. And she was like, after that, my teeth like pushed back in. Not sure if she made that part up, but I thought it was pretty funny. Okay, so this guy's stealing another guy's money bowl on a bus. Wait, what is this girl doing? Oh, that's sweet. Imagine planning this and filming this and being like, wow, people are gonna think I'm such a good person. Look how happy this dude is. And then you gotta strut off of the camera so everyone can see how shredded your midsection is. It, it's kind of like people who like write to the script for like other people to say that like they're great or they're beautiful or they're a hero. It's like Mr. Burns writing his own movie. All hail Mr. Burns. Nobody's driving this car. So this guy gets in, stops the car. Hero! Yeah, that, that heart, I can imagine. It's beaten. This isn't scripted at all. Oh, oh, that's funny. And he just runs away instead of fixing it. What a guy. Where are these three going? They run away. It must be something scary. Oh my goodness. That is so cute. Oh, look how tiny it is. That's so cute. Obviously fake, but wonderful, delicious success. Well, guys, that was funny comedy Asian TikToks. I had a pretty good time. Some of them were kind of weird. The jealous wife, jealous girlfriend, makeup double face thing, kind of weird, but like overall, very wholesome, very fun. I enjoyed it. I'd like to subscribe to this newsletter because I'd like to watch some more. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you hit push notifications if you'd like to see more of my videos and I will see you on the next one. Bye.